Hey everyone, welcome back to another installment of Around the League. Today we are covering a league that maybe some of you don't know about, uh, but it's one that has kind of drawn my attention in the last couple years, and I have become a huge fan of this upstart league, very similar to how I felt about the MLS when I was younger. Uh, but this is the Canadian Premier League, or the CPL. Now the CPL consists of eight teams. It is roughly on the same level of competitiveness as the USL Championship, so kind of a step below the MLS. Of course, the MLS has three teams that play up in Canada, and these teams all compete with the MLS teams for the Canadian Championship uh, for a variety of, of Continental Cup stuff, but not a lot of them have a lot of success. But there are eight teams, uh, and all of them play at somewhat familiar stadiums. If you're unfamiliar with some of them, they might be some smaller grounds, but uh, you might see some crossover with Canadian football. So we're going to start uh, in the east here and work all the way over to Vancouver. But in order to start, we have to zoom in here on Nova Scotia and find Halifax. So uh, we zoom in here on Halifax which sits on the kind of the central southern point here and we zoom in on the kind of heart of Halifax here and if we zoom in even further we are going to find a soccer stadium called Wanderers Grounds and Wanderers Grounds is this grassy area right here Wanderer Grounds that is home to HFX Wanderers the Halifax Wanderers uh, they are the easternmost team roughly the least successful team in the CPL in its current form uh, with the current teams that exist, but they do play there at that small stadium. Uh, about 6,500 people are able to fit into Nova Scotia there. We work our way then to the West. No teams play in Montreal, but if we go all the way to Toronto, we are looking for York Lions Stadium in Toronto. Of course, this is on the campus of York University. So if we zoom in here on Toronto and we work our way to the northern half, still south of the 407, but we find York University and we zoom in here, York Lions Stadium is going to be this football stadium right here. So the York Lions, uh, whether it be soccer or Canadian football, are going to play here, but it is also, here you see a soccer pitch, set up for York United FC. That is Toronto's local team outside of, of course, the MLS's uh, Toronto FC, which play in downtown Toronto. The other team that plays in the area is Forge FC. Now, Forge FC are going to play down in Hamilton at a stadium you might be familiar with. So if we zoom in on Hamilton here, and if I remember correctly from our uh, CFL video, it's going to be a little more to the east of downtown. And we're gonna find Tim Hortons Field. This of course, home to the CFL's Hamilton Tiger Cats, but that is home to Forge FC. Now Forge have won every single title in the history of the Canadian Premier League, except for one season. Um, and I believe that season was one of, if not the only one, where they actually won um, the table that year, or the ladder, however you want to think of standings in Canadian football. So much like the MLS, they have uh, sort of like a supporter shield where the best team during the season gets an award, um, but then they play for a playoff championship. And Forge has won every single one of those playoff championships, except for a single one where they were, in fact, runners up as well. We go to the west then, and we're going to go to Winnipeg and zoom in on Winnipeg to the home of Valor FC. Uh, they play on the campus of Manitoba University, which, if I'm not mistaken, sits to the... Let me zoom out here. I may have gotten a little too close. Manitoba University, yes, to the south. Zoom in here, uh, the former Canad Inn Stadium, or actually, that was the old stadium. This used to be known as IG Field. It's currently known as Princess Auto Stadium, also home to, there you see, the Winnipeg Blue Bombers, as well as the University of Manitoba. But that is home to Valor FC, the local team in Winnipeg. Only one team plays in Alberta. FC Edmonton folded after a few seasons, uh, and the other team that remains is in Calgary. 
Now, despite the fact that they play in Calgary, the name of the team is Cavalry, which always confuses me when I think of Calvary, which is a, a Christian term rather than Cavalry, but that is neither hither nor thither. Uh, cavalry play at Atco Field, which is in Foothills County, Alberta. So how are we going to find Foothills County? Um, if we zoom out here and we zoom in to kind of where the 201 meets the 22 X and we're going to find Atco Field at Spruce Meadows. Um, this a very it's it's an equestrian stadium and so it's got this very unique design very unique shape and these corners have these bizarre greek roman columns uh, that look really cool on camera when they're filming um but of course the the shape of this stadium is is somewhat bizarre and almost looks like a baseball stadium in design uh but that of course is home to cavalry cavalry fc in calgary and then last but not least, we zoom into Vancouver. Now, Vancouver, the general area has two teams. The first one is the newest team in the CPL, and that is Vancouver FC, not to be confused with Vancouver Whitecaps FC, which play in MLS, uh, but they play in Langley. So uh, to find Langley, we go to Vancouver downtown. We go to the southeast through Burnaby, through Surrey, all the way into Langley. We zoom in here and we are looking for Willoughby Community Park Stadium. So how are we going to find Willoughby Community Park Stadium? If you go to the north of Langley and continue roughly straight directly north of downtown Langley, going past all these residential areas and continuing to the north, continuing to the north, and there's Willoughby Community Park. Uh, there's a secondary school there and right in this area a professional soccer team plays right here at willoughby community park that of course is home to the eagles or vancouver fc and last but not least we zoom out of langley here and we have to move onto the island uh not necessarily vancouver because this is home to pacific fc it's in langford british columbia which is more toward the victoria area here on vancouver island so we go to the west of Victoria, the provincial capital, find ourselves in Langford, and we're looking for Starlight Stadium. And Starlight Stadium going to sit to the west of Langford. If we find our way between these two lakes here, just directly west, go past the Walmart, and you're gonna find a series of soccer venues here. Uh, Starlight Stadium, they're the one with the stands. That is home to my favorite Canadian football team, uh, or soccer team, as you have seen in videos uh, where I show my face on screen. There's a little scarf behind me for Pacific FC. The only other winner of the Canadian League Championship outside of Forge FC. Of course, it was Forge that they beat to win that title. Um, but promising not so much this year to see if they'll capture another one. But uh, I am hopeful for my Tridents to uh, pull something out for the rest of the season.